There are two questions this week about probiotics and gut bacteria and uh, there are I'll just address them both in one because there are a number of ways to increase the your colon health and one of them is definitely making sure that the the uh, all the beneficial bacteria um, are uh, are there. Your colon is filled. It's like a like a rainforest with all these. Uh, it's and it's alive because there's so much uh, bacteria that are that are good and beneficial that help you digest your food and um, are play a role in your immune system that it needs to be preserved. And that's why oftentimes taking antibiotics too quickly disrupts like years and years of of, uh, of a flourishing rainforest could be wiped out by taking antibiotics and then you have to wait for it to grow again and if you if you end up uh, you know uh, killing everything off then sometimes uh, yeast and uh, other uh, other uh, opportunistic organisms may end up uh, growing where it should have been bacteria that are supposed to be beneficial to the to the system and then when you have overgrown yeast and you have other problems it spreads other places and then that's why it's such a big um, problem nowadays because there's so much antibiotic use so ways to increase it of course just eating fermented foods uh, fermented foods could even be fermented dairy foods such as yogurt there's and because these all these things have bacteria in them and then there's also prebiotics such as uh, there's something called fructo oligosaccharides they're found in uh, bananas they they help to keep your the microflora b- balance in your body um, honey and uh, is also shown to be um, extremely beneficial for uh, I think specifically um, uh, honey from New Zealand uh, manuka honey but um, I think probably any honey would be uh, it would it, it it's, it's shown to, um, that it helps to balance the bacteria in your intestine and uh, when people who have um, these uh, fermented foods and uh, um, um, healthy colon bacteria actually have better better, better bowel movements and it's shown to have an increase in you know, people's lifespan and then there's uh, some other things as well like uh, uh, at least people have used olive leaf extracts for um, helping uh, gastrointestinal disorders and um, diarrhea and, and and actually it's thought to, to be because of its probiotic effect, uh, probiotic effect it helps the ba- gut bacteria in some way so those are a few tips um, keep your food as simple and um, uh, whole as possible and uh, allow for uh, some uh, a part of fermentation fermented foods to be in the in, in the diet